It's finally Friday, Aiken. I'm Michelle Jackson, and I'm here to bring you the front page. In our leading local stories, police need your help in finding a missing person. Devontae Williams, a 23-year-old, has not been seen since January the 18th. He was last seen in the Warrenville area. The Aiken County Sheriff's Office is asking for the public's help in locating Williams. The Yellow Jackets are preparing to sting. The North Augusta girls basketball team will play South Point in Columbia on Saturday for a chance to win its third straight state championship. The game tips off at 5.30 p.m. at Colonial Life Arena. I'll be back with more stories after a word from our sponsor. Everyone's a welcome guest at Crescent Automotive. We're Aiken's Choice Award winner four years in a row. That probably has a lot to do with our low upfront windshield pricing and no additional processing fees. Remember, everybody drives Crescent. You should too. It's the first day of Women's History Month. In the 80s, when Carol Jansen accepted a new job at the Savannah River National Laboratory, she was one of only three women in her workplace. Find out more about how she challenged biases as a female scientist in the male-dominated field. Frugal Book Fair Shopping. The AAUW Books and Things Fair will continue throughout the weekend at the former site of Bargain Blowouts Furniture. Proceeds will be used to fund scholarships and grants that promote literacy and education. To read more about these stories, visit AikenStandard.com. I'm Michelle Jackson, and thank you for watching The Front Page. Enjoy that weekend.